If you've lived here long enough, you've no doubt heard of dew points, but today we're going to learn how to forecast dew points and some of the science behind it. Your local weather expert, Peyton Malone, is joining us now. And Peyton, just give us a quick definition. What are dew points? A dew point is an actual temperature um, that we use, and it tells you how uh, the cool the temperature needs to be to get basically a cloud or rainfall. So if your dew point and your temperature match, then you get a cloud form. And simply put, that's that's what it is. And what does that number mean, Peyton? Well, for for you and for most you know meteorologists, we use it to tell you how much moisture is in the air. So you hear about relative humidity a lot, but what's more important or what is a better uh, figure to use to determine how humid it is is the dew point itself. So the higher the dew point, uh, the more uncomfortable it feels. The lower the dew point. Um, um, the more comfortable it's going to feel outside. And why does a higher dew point make it feel uncomfortable? Well, it all has to do with how your, you know, your skin um, feels the moisture. So when you have dew points in the 80s, right, that's very, very rare that we get that humid. But that's that air you can wear. And as it drops lower, of course, the 70s is still pretty sticky. And as you go into the 60s, the 50s, that's when it's very comfortable. But you ask, why does it feel hotter? And it all has to do uh, with, right, the heat index value. And it all has to do with how we sweat. So if you don't sweat, if, if mammals don't sweat, then they don't feel uh, the humidity. And the reason you feel hotter is because because sweat evaporates and when sweat evaporates it cools off your skin and when your humidity is higher the sweat is not able to evaporate and because of that um, your skin does not cool off. And so Peyton how do you forecast dew points? It all has to do with the moisture right so we simply track the moisture the higher the moisture the more uh, the higher the dew point is going to be so when we get in these deep tropical environments like we see during the summer our dew points are naturally going to be higher when we're in the winter we get these cool fronts pushing in drier air your dew points are going to be lower. All right, Peyton Malone explaining dew points to us. I feel like so much more knowledgeable. Thank you, <laughs> Peyton. Appreciate it.